Size coffees. This is the largest they have. They don't understand the sadness of my eyes. They're so sad because they haven't slept enough. That's okay. I'll drink this with love. Um, also, they've given us a random pastry of some sort that I'll eat. We'll see. I, I don't know. And uh, Chris is going to have a patatas frita. Random pastry. Has an has uh, some sort of fruit filling, and I don't know what it is, but I'll eat it. I'm not gonna have lunch again for quite some time. It'll be after I've had a lot of sun, so I feel like something needs to go in my belly. How is your patata frita? stopped for something we're not sure what but there's a little I don't know swamp area because we're in South this, America this might Panama be, no, Central, America. Central America I think this Panama. might be the uh, border crossing maybe it's a border crossing Margana. we'll find out I mean I know it's not Nazis right but what there's is it tomorrow. okay no drain.
We made it with actual time to spare to the port after having a, an entire full car going to the wrong port and then figuring it out and making it to the port. The clouds have rolled in, but we knew this would happen. Are we worried, Chris? I wasn't worried, but we left real early, so just in case we popped up. Yeah, no, I mean about the clouds rolling in. Oh, no. No. It rains. In, it ra in Panama, in the rainy season. But it doesn't rain for long. Look at the camera. Show me your pretty eyes. <laughs> So I left everything important at the hotel. Like, you know, the waterproof housing for this guy or the, the waterproof uh, thing that I had for this phone that I'm using right now or like uh, the, you know, something to be waterproof for the trip to just not get everything soaked. Uh, check, check. I think we're gonna have a blast anyway. I'm just not going to care because that is my MO. Cat, on the other hand, she cares a lot. She cares more for both of us. She's caring for two, because I'm a psychopath. We made it into the boat. We had to limbo. It wasn't pretty, I didn't film it. I felt like I did, um, you know, bar tricks, like I haven't done since I was in my third grade. Monkey bar. Yeah, monkey bars. Anyway, so uh, we're still waiting on our eight missing people. I don't we, think they we, made it. No. That's so Oregon Trail, really? that road over here. It really is, and also we haven't left yet. We could be on an island already. Because That's okay, I don't care, I'm chilling. Because Martha has died of, of dysentery on the way. I've never played Oregon Trail, so I don't care about these illusions. <laughs> it's brutal. Let me just tell you, it's brutal, baby. I know everyone dies from dysentery. Yeah, you, you were like, I want to leave all the characters off my family. <laughs> <laughs>
Welcome to the San Blas Islands. Actually, we are in Gunayala. Guna no, 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 actually, we're in Isla Perro. Perro Chico. Chico. <laughs> but this Isla is also Gunayala. This yeah. is their country. Yeah. Not just the San Blas is a slave name, it's government name. Yeah. Uh, and it's we just got off of a very bumpy boat. Bumpy. But um, I've got a beer. We have a beautiful place to sit, and we're going to be getting some snorkeling gear in a moment. So, mm -hmm. so far, so good. Perfect. There's a, uh, a sunken boat here. It's like caution flag. Yeah, it's cautioned off. By a flag. It, no, I think it's, it's a, a police line. Dog. No, it's a, it's a crime scene. Um, I'm pretty sure we get to go You get to snorkel on a crime scene? Nice. You want to be him on a paddleboard? Yeah. Could have brought my inflatables. The only problem with that is I'd be out of the water. You'd be out of the water. Oh my goodness, it's getting show, cold on my show, belly button. Show that. Show that. Nada más gasolina. Perhaps people stay on huts. Perhaps they stay in that, that two story of a. Oh yeah. But I think people stay there. You guys like really swim over to the next island. Next island is like right over there. Of course, you could just take one of your little kayak like homemade kayaks. Or, or if you're like really into it, you could take your mega yacht between the islands. You know, if you got 50 million, you Jeff Bezos, why not? snorkels and we really should have brought our own because we have our own and these are oh, okay maybe and it doesn't have fins or anything I have fins I could have brought my own fins whatever I'm not complaining but point being we also don't have a GoPro that will show you anything we see so take the following footage from a uh, let's say a tank of goldfish maybe a tank of, of, of you know, tropical fish, whatever I can find online, as to be what we saw while we were snorkeling in the uh, Atlantic. We're in the Atlantic. We haven't been in the Atlantic in a while. Uh, in the San Blas Islands. Yeah. I was just about to take my phone snorkeling that way. This iPhone 13 Pro says it's water resistant up to 30 feet or whatever. Check me on that. But uh, I just don't want to risk it. I did dip in the water to do this like. Uh, but that's not the same thing. The reason why I want to take it is because past that buoy right over there, I found a little curled up sleeping nerf shark. Now I say little, it was easy, big enough to eat my entire arm. Like, one bite. They won't, they're nice, but I'm just saying, if it was wanting to, that's the size of it. It's pretty pretty big, like a, like a Rottweiler? Yeah, I think Rottweiler, it's about the size of a Rottweiler. Pero, all of our footage is on his phone right now, and, and I No, we can't risk, no. we can't risk taking the phone for that. Heard it? Pretty sure these are the places you get to stay if you stay here. Not sure all of them are are fully ready to be stayed in. Can I take a picture?
Oh, so there's a bathroom in there. Okay. Yeah. Are you? Are you? Is it just you, or is it? Are you got like? Just you? Okay. Nice. That's pretty cool. Nice. Yeah. días? How many days? Uh, only one night. Okay. All right. Pretty sure that's a ray right there. That black thing. Or a bag. It's a ray or a bag. All right, baby. So tell me about your experience thus far. It's not, okay, so listen, when you look at the actual tours and you book them on TripAdvisor, they have this long list of things to not complain about, Yeah. Um, which makes you concerned that your trip is going to be horrible. But really what it makes you, what it should make you realize is that some people are really dumb and complain a lot. Yeah, yeah. And it's like, don't complain about the trash. Don't complain that it's sort of primitive. Don't don't complain about you know the people speaking Spanish and not English. Right. Don't. I mean, it's really kind of ridiculous. Yeah. So we've only been to one island thus far, and it's been fabulous. And I would already have paid my seventy nine dollars for it. Yeah, like, honestly. We went and took the cheap tour, uh, even though we we're looking at all the other tours where you go on a personal boat and all that good stuff. Maybe that would have been fun next time. I promise her next time. We only had a small amount of time, and that kind of dictated what we ended up choosing. Yeah. So so we went on kind of a relatively inexpensive one. And uh, thus far, yes, the, the road here was crazy. Yeah. Yes, the we boat had to pick ride up here some extra was bumpy. <laughs> uh, and, yeah, we picked up extra people, that's right. We got some hitchhikers, oh, including a baby. Yeah, um, like six people, six, six souls. Six people <laughs> off-roading with a baby. Yeah. Uh, but like, the... the the people are lovely. Yeah, the, innocent. They're innocent. <laughs> why do travel? Why did yeah. travel advisor tell us Trip over and over how innocent the people yeah, are? Yeah, they kept on talking about how innocent the like, grown up people are. So we don't are. murder them because they're innocent. It's like, you look, you can con them into anything. <laughs> like I don't get it. No. But uh, the water is lovely. Yeah. Um, there's not a like. There's some snorkeling. You can see some fish, and there is. Like, I saw. I saw a shark. He saw a shark, which yeah. is super cool. I did not see the shark. It's at the back of the so sunken shark. Next time you're down here, guarantee it's probably still there. The sunken boat, not the sunken shark, but both were sunken if, if we're the video. Mm -hmm. uh, we walked up on somebody who lived in a cabin and they were super cool and, and let us look inside. Yeah, that was nice. pretty cool. And then took pictures of us on a hammock. Yeah. Uh, it, it's been lovely experience I've enjoyed and we've it. only started yeah just getting started uh we got we're still gonna get in the middle of the ocean and just jump out of the water where it's shallow and then uh my concern is getting back in the boat oh yeah well I'll be drunk by then I don't know if I have enough beer to be drunk by then I'll be pretty high too hopefully that thing guards out okay we can't see that on the tv hi I'm Chris and I don't get high and that's Kat and together we are not getting higher so. not at all my food has a face. No, I not ready to retire. I gotta get used to eating the fish's face. Because I'm gonna be in a boat. You know what? I don't want to eat the fish's face, even then. You know that I was, I was Christopher. Two days ago. Two days ago, like this is Listen, I ate the fish like a big girl. You don't know how proud I am of that. I took bones out of my mouth put them on the plate. I didn't cry. I didn't like point them out to the rest of the world. It was like I was a big girl in a uh, place that I could have looked like a total a-hole. And I was not the total a-hole. You're welcome. USA, USA, Estados Unidos. I did not do you wrong today. It is now time for us to pack up. We're about to go to the next island in our little boat, our uh, really bumpy boat. I don't actually mind it though. I, I kept looking at the horizon like I was gonna maybe get sick, but I didn't feel sick. So I don't know, maybe the horizon worked or maybe it just wasn't sick inducing. I'm not sure which. Okay, time to pack up. We just had another chance to test whether the iPhone is waterproof. That's got forgotten. Just let it sink with her. You put it in my boot, and my boots need to go underwater. Yep. So, it worked. <laughs> 
We are in the middle of the ocean, standing, quite literally, in the middle, in of, the the middle ocean. of the ocean. Stop it, Chris. You can't say the exact same thing as me on your video. Wait, what? No, it's just the same thing. So video. rude. This is literally what he usually does, and I have to Wait. edit it out. It's so annoying. What? What is that? Where did that camera come from? The, who the hell are you? I was just by myself in the middle of the ocean. Anyway, we're standing in the middle of the ocean. It's freaking amazing. Um, and this is, we're going to stay here for a half an hour and the boat will chill while we do so. I'm going to go get a beer for this because why not? And also, I just can't say how much fun I'm having so far. Chris is like, how do you get out of the boat? Do you get out of the boat like this? And like, flew into the water. He's having a decent time as well. You can see him wandering off into the distance. Ah, I'm getting hit by a boat. Here's a boat. Great time. We are in the middle of the ocean standing. Stop it, Chris. Right. You can't say the exact same thing as me on your video. This this here where it gets dark? That's where the ocean stops. It's like light over here and dark over there. It's all coral. It's all coral. Don't go in the dark spots. Keep your feet up. It looks to be some sort of coral. Alright. Hey, there's wife. Hello, wife. When husband leaves, husband takes with him everything. Do things that husband will not allow you to do while husband's gone. What is that? While husband's away. What does husband not let me do? Get beers from husband's beer. bags. It's true that I want beers from my husband's bag. While husband is How sleeping. Did you know? Go get whatever you want. Husband, husband has beer. You can take husband's beer. I'm going to husband's beer. <laughs> For this next part, we get 20 minutes to just kind of walk in this knee deep water. What? We're not allowed to. I want to go that way. Yeah. We're not allowed to, we're not allowed to touch the starfish again. You keep on going, no, they slap my hands. Get your hands away from my starfish. Pescado. No. Pescado. Estrella, pescado, no. This is miles and miles of ankle deep water. I am naked and I am afraid. What's this? You found an island. Look at all the conch shells on this island. Dude, look at this. Oh, wow. Look, they're all cracked open at the top, so somebody's... Well, be here in a minute. You want to keep somebody's eating these cones. Oh, my God. I, I can't clean the island. Somebody's already been here. Everybody's just out here conch fishing. This is how we get our conch fritters. Should they not be doing that? That'd make it work. We got a foundation there. It was here. Yeah, you can build from that foundation. I'm on a deserted island. Like the two S's? I 
deserted mm -hmm. island. Oh look, creme brulee. They just got dulces. <laughs> My wife, lost to the wilds. And that's the last I ever saw of her. I were in the middle of the ocean. Yeah, so, uh, so far, trip's going great. Uh, didn't have a gluten-free meal choice no. for lunch, so. It was all fried. Yeah. Frito. Frito was fritos. But I, frito. I ate some roast. Um, Arroz. But, uh, yeah. Uh, definitely. We'll have a good dinner for tonight, so we'll keep control of what he's going to do. Laying in the middle of the ocean in really shallow water is, uh, you know, uh, five out of five stars, for sure. Yeah. I would definitely recommend you do this. Here's some, some chips if you want. I do have some chips. Now that we're going back to that topic. I really kind of wish I had my sunglasses right now. Oh, there's my sunglasses. I was just wondering where my sunglasses... Oh, there's, there's... We're not in the middle of the ocean. I lied. Oh my god, there's other people. <laughs> where did they come from? Yeah. Okay. This is not oh. an. <laughs> there's cat. <laughs> edit all of them out. <laughs> <laughs> edit all of them. Out. Oh, well, there's Listen. a tiny island over there. Listen, okay. I'll be honest. There's other people here. But it doesn't detract from the fact that this is awesome. <laughs> yeah. Good thing. Sometimes you gotta do stuff with other human beings in the background. Go for it. Booty. Talking, talking, talking. What's crazy is they take these little boats. These like Uber kayaks, and they're out there in the middle of the ocean catching fish with them. They got like, look, this guy's got like a little spear in there so he can spear fish. But yeah, they're out there in the middle, way out in the, out in the, out in the open. We saw them in these tiny, tiny little boats. Oh yeah, manpower dinghy. Isla Diablo and it's actually right across from the first island we were at so I don't know cheating I don't know maybe but um, we are gonna get in the water for the last bit of our trip maybe look at, at uh, a little of their wares and pretty much complete our sunblast dude I'm in the middle of videotaping no hipping no hipping during the middle of videotaping tell them yeah I want to see what they got in the stores these scarves are what they're known for. I don't know if they're scarves, but yeah, embroidery. Oh, that's cool looking over there. Yeah. We are officially done with our San Blas trip, port over there, and uh, I'm totally sunburned, but I had a great time. And I think our plan now is to head back to the hotel and then figure out a place to eat, but uh, we'll see. Listen, we cannot overestimate how bad these roads are. Like, yeah, we can. No, we cannot overestimate it. Like, it sounds like everything is fine right now, but like, okay, every two seconds. We, I think oh, she oh, wants to say, seriously? Do not underestimate. No, I'm saying we cannot overestimate it. We cannot overestimate it. There's no way of overestimating. Like, right now, everything is fine, and then suddenly death. Death happens often on these roads. So don't underestimate it. Well, yeah, you don't underestimate them. That would be bad, but I'm just saying it cannot be overestimated. Oh, 
Abuela Paloma. I've got an idea to build a canal. It'll be a series of inconnect, interconnected dams. We're still away from the Ton to Pedro Miguel, all the way down to Miraflores. To let the boats go through. Wow, you sound like a man with a plan and a canal in Panama.